welcome back to my channel hello everybody this is glenda marie coming back to you with the dollar tree haul i have a dollar tree haul i picked up uh, a couple things last week i pick up picked up a couple things this week and i'm just going to combine them all in one and i also want y'all to check out this makeup now i went to sephora and um uh, got a couple samples from the Fenty, the Fenty makeup. I got, um, I'm looking down because I got samples from so far. Um, Fenty, the Fenty concealer number 450 and 445 and the Fenty foundation in 460. Does it look like it matched my skin? Y'all tell me. I put my lashes on today. I put my nails on for y'all today. I got my nails on, girl. My hands are ashy, but I got, I got them on. I just got to washing my hands. But anyway, I just wanted to <clears throat> put on a little makeup, make myself feel a little bit better. Um, this, uh, this week, um, I went and had a biopsy. Um, as I've stated in, uh, another, a couple videos before, I don't know if anybody's watched them. Um, I was diagnosed with multiple myeloma cancer, uh, April of last year, 2018. So it's, uh, I had a transplant in October of last year. So it's been a year, uh, for the transplant almost. And so I had to get a biopsy. Uh, I think I go on the 11th of November to get the results. So let's be prayerful, prayerful uh, please, if anybody's out there who knows the words of prayer and you know who God is, say a little prayer for your girl, okay? All right, so we're going to get in, right into the uh, hall, okay? Um, first of all... Um, I actually have, uh, let's see, I got these rug, these non-slip rug underlays. Uh, a, couple, uh, a couple months ago or a month ago, I had got a, a bunch of rugs uh, from, um, if anybody watched my uh, family uh, Dollar General haul, I had got some rugs. And so now I need to make them non-slip. Um, I also got one of these moisturizers. These things really work. It's a moisture eliminator. Now, I have had this um, in a basement where there was a little moisture. And it will fill this little bottom container like the top of it is filled with whatever but this will fill up with water it really works four dollar if you have any moisture and see i'm gonna put this in my garage we don't have any moisture but there's a there's like a window that's kind of like this but it's glass and so some moisture can get in there so i'm gonna put one of these down here um then I also got these. Now, um, I got some heritage jars and I got, um, uh, actually, I'm, a, actually, I'm going to put, uh, what I got from, uh, this might be a long haul, so I'm going to put what I got from the, from also that I got from um, garage sale. I went to a couple garage sales last weekend. But these are two letters just to put on the things. Like I do have, um, I do have, hold on. I do have one of these and it makes labels. But I was going to try these letters and put them on some labels and just put these on the labels and see how that works so I got three it has 370 letters in there but I gotta we have a lot of things that I want to label so you know 
And moving on, um, freshly, I got this portrait, freshly baked with love for the kitchen. I'm doing a black and white sea green. One second. All right, sorry about that, y'all. Somebody was at the door. Uh, the dog got out. So again, here's those letters. Um, another thing I got is the clear push pins. Uh, we have a uh, bulletin board, and I put those up. Uh, we needed these to, you know, put up different stuff on the bulletin board. Here, let me show you. Let me turn it around. Oh no, I can't turn it around, but hold on one sec. Okay, I'm back. Okay, again, here goes. Here's some push pins that I got because we have a bulletin board and we needed some more pins for that. <clears throat> I got one of these for my great niece, uh, just so she can have. It is a medicine dropper and spoon. Uh, right now, uh, my great niece, she has like an upper respiratory um, infection and an earache. And I like to, and I get them, I, I watch them a lot, my great niece and great nephew. And I like to have things on hand. I like to have everything they need when they come over here. And y'all not going to believe this, but Old Spice deodorant, $1 at the dollar store. Now, if I, I forgot to, uh, well, not forgot, but I didn't have any coupons, but there's usually a coupon for a dollar off, but I didn't have any. But just so you know, if you have husbands, sons, because I actually got three of these. Um, so all the same kind. They they had um, two different kind, but the they like um, the actual the thick white type of um, the they don't like the clear. The clear kind. The clear kind, it breaks them out. All three of them. My my two sons and my boyfriend, They it breaks them out. So, we don't like... I don't buy any gel deodorant. So, that was that. And... Um, I showed you that. Mm. Um, I got a candle snuffer, $1. I love to light candles. I love candles. We have a lot of candles, so I thought that was cute. They had this white one. They had a silver one and uh, this black one, I mean. They had black, silver, and gold. Okay. Um, and here we go. This says family. I'm building a portrait wall. And I wanted to add this in there. It's real nice. It has on the back of it where you can hang it. I'm going to try to hang it as best as, as best as I can, honey. Um, and I also got, again, the other deodorant. One of the other deodorants. That's two deodorants. And... I got this little portrait. This is cute. This is actually going to be sitting somewhere in my bedroom. Or, some yeah, somewhere in my bedroom. It's a little portrait. You can hang it. But I'm going to set it on like a, a um, easel. A little picture easel. I got that one. And this little mermaid one. This is for my spring decor. My actual spring decor is um, beach theme, mermaid, kisses, starfish wishes. That's cute. So I, I have that for when spring comes back around. And I got this for 
It says, I need coffee. It, oh, <laughs> I need coffee. It's a little thing for my coffee station over there. Just a little something to put by my coffee station. I thought that was cute. And let's see what else. Um, I got this little decoration, this little top hat. I've been watching some tutorials on DIYs, and I've been getting ideas, so this is something to go for DIY for Christmas. Um, what else did I get? Um, I got this birthday bag. It, it done got bent up for my mom. Tomorrow's my mom's birthday. Happy birthday to you. So I'm going to fill this bag up with goodies. Um, I got her two cards. I don't know how they got bent up, but, you know, two cards. And they got some great cards, y'all. This one says, um, this one says, Mom, beautiful, generous, thoughtful, and kind. So many reasons to love you. Happy birthday. And that explains her. Um, this one. A mother's love is a beautiful blessing. There's, There are so many reasons to thank you, so many reasons to love you, so many reasons to wish you happiness on your birthday and every day. So, that's for my mommy. Um, one of my favorite candies, Blow Pops, $1.00. <clears throat> a laundry gu guide I got this for my laundry room my laundry room decor is black and white also I love it it has like telling the mainly for the kids telling the kids if it has this do this it has uh, machine wash machine wash permanent press Machine wash, delicate, hand wash. It has all kind of things on there. And it's a stand. You know, it just, it's just going to sit. I'm going to sit it on the ledge in, in the laundry room. thought that was cute. Okay. <clears throat> then I also got these two little statues for my daughter's room. Just to put on her little shelves. Um, her room is Paris theme. Both of them have kind of um, Paris, but my 15-year-old, her room is all Paris. Paris and Chanel. Her name is Chanel. And so Coco Chanel in Paris, she wanted the, um, it's kind of like, a, it's black, pink, gold, and white in her room. I'm going to show y'all one day. When I'm finished fixing it up, I'm going to show you. Um, um, I got some of these corner guides again for my great niece um, she's uh, 16 months and so you know we, we need this stuff now she's starting to get into stuff so yeah I got that <clears throat> um, I also got spatulas this big one and a smaller one. Now, I have spatulas already, of course, but we got some new copper um, pots and pans. And, you know, you can't use, you shouldn't use the metal with it. So, I got these just so we could, uh, you know, the kids won't scratch up the pots. So, you know, got those. Um... I also got these jumbo plastic um, clothes pins, but I'm going to use them for my uh, DIYs, holding things together. I may use them as uh, potato chip bag clips, all kind of things. One dollar for six. Mm. Oh, I also got this scooper. I got this scoop for my flower um, bowl 
my heritage bowl that I got found the biggest one that I found uh, inside of um, uh, I found it at a garage sale that I'm going to show you here in a minute but this is for um, flour okay one dollar I also use these for like ice our ice we don't have our, uh, ice maker so we have to buy ice um, so we put the ice in the refrigerator and you can just scoop it out. We have a bigger one for that. But I'm, I'm thinking I should go back and get another one this size. Because they had this color and I believe they had a red. And shopping bags. I got shopping bags. I got three. No. Oh, I got two shopping bags. Again, that black and white print. I, I uh, tote bags, whatever they call, they call tote bags, but I call them shopping bags. But just to put little things in to match the decor around the house, honey. Yeah, I got those two. Let me put these over here. Uh, I got, I didn't get a lot, but I got enough. So I actually got this corner shelf. Um, it's a corner shelf. It's for cups and things, but I'm not going to use it for the cups. I'm going to find something else to use it for. So that was, and it's, and it's pretty, a pretty good, pretty sturdy. So yeah, that's for a dollar. And then I got these baskets. It's three of them. And I'm going to use these for storage in the kitchen. I'm a DIY something for the kitchen. It's going to be real nice. Real nice. Uh, a few more things. Uh, again, a DIY. I got these three. I got three of these trees. I'm going to start DIYing for Christmas. To get ready for Christmas. There's three of them. And there should be one more bag. Oh, here it is. Mm. And I also got three of these because these are going to help make these trees fuller. So I, I grabbed three. I know I'm probably not going to need that much, but... Uh, I also probably put some on uh, our banister. We have one banister, or I may put some out on the balcony, on the uh, patio. So I got three of those. And then I got three of these to go with the three trees. These are going to hold the trees together. I may videotape. No, I don't know if I'm going to tape it or not, but those are for the trees. When you see how it, when I watch the DIY, I, for, I forget um, her name, um, who I watched. Um, I'm going to try to link the video below. And um, she used these jars to hold the trees. So, they come with um, the stand. They come with the stand. But I'm not going to use the stand. And last but not least, from Dollar Tree, mothballs. I heard they keep, I'm going to put these in the garage. I heard they keep mice and snakes and stuff like that. It's getting warm. And, I mean, it's getting cold outside and the mice are going to start coming in. We don't want that. I don't want that at all at all okay so yes that that's it for dollar tree